Hello everybody, back here again for our vlog a day, and today is Monday the 19th, and today is a rather interesting day. Um, I was doing some general like house clean type work, clean up the front porch and that, getting it all cleaned off. I've had some of that leftover from the ceiling was falling down from the roof was leaking way back when. Got all that stuff cleaned up, I had a bunch of just junk out there left over, some planting type stuff and that that I need to get cleaned up. Just things that I'm not using anymore, just old bird feeders and crap that I'm never going to probably use. Most of the stuff, a lot of it is my exes, some of my own stuff, just crap like that that I need to get rid of. Um, I went ahead and just clean it up, got a phone call from my grandfather wanting to know if I'd run down to my dad's farm with him. He couldn't reach him, he hadn't heard from him all day and that. Uh, they had a relative telling that he was doing horrible and that and that he couldn't get out of the chair last night and so on and so forth. So my grandpa got all worried and concerned. So. We went ahead and headed down. I told him to come and get me. So we just jumped in the um, truck, took off down there. Um, he was fine. It wasn't a big deal. He actually had somebody with him. That's why he didn't bother calling. Thought they knew there was somebody there with him. But they didn't. So we ended up down there anyway, talking to him for a little while. Found out he had a doctor appointment in a tumbler today. So I went ahead and headed up there for that. So I ended up, instead of going to the landfill and going to the dump, finish cleaning my house, the front porch up and all that stuff, I ended up up in a tumble most of the day. Um, got dropped back off here. Um, went ahead and got some stuff done, got a text, I want to know if I would be willing to take um, this dog right here, um, not really sure. His name is Arrow, I don't like the name Arrow, I'm feeling Bruce, <clears throat> so I'm not really sure how to refer to him. He, I, I call him Arrow because he hasn't listened to Bruce yet, but he's going to become Bruce. So I would end up going and getting him today. Um, I haven't dog proofed my house yet, I did test drive him I guess technically. <clears throat> Saturday, he's the one I was talking about, Friday and Saturday. And I didn't go and see him at all on Sunday, but I'm guiding today. We went for a six mile run, ended up doing a 1047 pace, I think it was overall. We did stop about three and a half miles into it. I let him rest, let him lay down, take a little nap there, kind of rest up. Then I went ahead and brought him on home the rest of the distance and had a really good time. It was dark out, so it was running at night. He's a black dog, wasn't real happy about that, but I had my flashing lights, my headlight on, all that good stuff. So definitely it's going to be an interesting evening tonight. So like I said, my house isn't dog proof, so he's actually tied to the foot of my bed. And he's going to sleep in bed with me, which isn't a big deal, but I don't want him running around the house and that and just kind of tearing up stuff that I haven't been able to put away. So definitely ought to be an interesting, fun day. Just I kind of enjoyed having him here. I've been the stress of my dad and that, and the, he's not knowing how long he's got to live. The pain is just horrendous. He tried to have an MRI today. He couldn't have the MRI because he just couldn't lay flat on his back. His shoulder's so bad in pain. So. It's just, it really that sucked. It's a lot of stress, a lot of just weighing on me. So I'm really kind of glad to have the dog around and go from there. So definitely, definitely looking forward to getting to know him more, getting him calmed down, getting used to the house, and getting him out exercising every single day and getting him wore out, keeping him tired out. So he's definitely a different dog. Like right now, he is just, he's whooped. This wasn't the case on like Friday and Saturday and that. He was definitely uh, not this whooped yet. So he's definitely having a good time here and... That's really all I know, I guess, for now, so I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Have yourself a safe and wonderful day, and thanks for watching.